Hi, it's Mitch from PickDogs.com. Here's your free pick in the Jazz versus Knicks NBA matchup on Wednesday, December 13th, 2023. Of course, we do tons of free picks every day at Pick Dogs, but if you're looking for the games you like the best, we put those under the premium picks tab at PickDogs.com. You can use that discount code PICK, get 15% off all of your purchases. We also have Dime Club and Sharp Trading Plays not available on the website. The only place to get those is by texting the number that you see on the screen. Um, these are meant for people who make big bets. If that's you, text that number. But let's get to this one. Jazz taking on the Knicks. The Knicks, you know, 13-9 and nine on the season. Kind of going back and forth here. Um, appear to have the talent to kind of go forward and to a type of team that if they get into the playoffs, like we saw last year when they beat up on the Cavaliers, that could definitely cause some, t- some teams some problems. But on the other side of things, um, you know, the Cavaliers also a, a team that, uh, you know, uh, I mean, the uh, Knicks, also a team that we've seen fall short at times, like that game in Boston where the Celtics just kind of busted them up recently when I thought the Knicks probably had a good chance. And also against the Milwaukee Bucks in the uh, in-season tournament, they went to Milwaukee and got just absolutely crushed by the Bucks. But overall, the Knicks have been pretty decent. Of course, we saw them against the Raptors, beating him 136-130, and then, uh, you know, wins against the Raptors prior to that, while losses, those losses to the Bucks and the, and the, and the Celtics in between all that. But it's been, anytime they play the, the winnable games, I think this is, this, is where, this is where we are with the Knicks, it is... When they play against like the Pistons, the Raptors, uh, the Hornets, teams like that, pretty much count as a win. When they play against the Celtics, the Bucks, the Suns, those are the teams they lose to. So, in order for the Knicks, to, the Timberwolves, when they go, to, in order for the Knicks to go to that next level, they're going to have to be able to beat those teams and not just beat them once in a blue moon, but, but to get the best of them in those season series. And we just haven't seen that from the Knicks yet. On the other side of this one, the Utah Jazz not really having a very good year at all, losing their last three games, most of them against good teams. The last one came against the Portland Trailblazers, and you know they also lost to the Memphis Grizzlies somewhere back in that pack as well. So the Jazz not even taking advantage of the opportunities that they have and probably looking like a team that's going to be drafting pretty high this season unless they turn things around in a hurry. 7-15 and 15 coming in, that's about 33% worse than 33% winning percentage. And that's generally where the bottom of the league teams fall. We look at how the Jazz and why the Jazz are here. Now, it's usually the same story as most of the other teams that are bad. It's their defense absolutely stinks. The Knicks offense, certainly nothing to write home about. They can shoot the three very well, shooting 38.4%. But outside of that, the Knicks offense isn't good. But they're going to look good against this uh, Jazz defense, which is not non-existent. And, of course, the Knicks, the strongest part of their team is their defensive basketball. I just think for me, defense travels. And like I said earlier, the Knicks against the bad teams isn't where they have their problems. I'm going to go with the New York Knicks here, and that's going to be my free pick. Of course, while you're doing your picks, putting your bets in, use our free betting tools at sportschatplace.com, 100% free, and they'll help put you on the most favorable bets on the board today.